going to be showing you how to make this watermelon fortune teller. It's pretty easy to make. All you need for this fortune teller is a A4 sheet paper. You will also need some scissors. And you will also need some color pencils. But if you don't have color pencils, you can use markers, crayons, anything you have. So that's all you need for the fortune teller and before we get started don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you guys will never miss a video when I upload and further ado let's get started. Get started. So you take your A4 sheet paper and you take your A4 sheet paper and fold it into a triangle to half like this. and then press it down like it should be like this it should be half here like this and then you take your scissors and you cut the cut the half here now i didn't press it i didn't i didn't fold it properly so i have to fold it again so now you take your scissors and cut the paper. There we go. It should be like this and the paper is cut so we don't need that. So you take this paper, now you open it. Open it and then from the other side you fold it again. From this side, fold it again and press it down with your fingers. Then you open it again and then you switch the sides and you fold it again. like this and you press it again and you open it and then it should be like this with, with, with four sides now you now you have to fold all four triangles Like this. And it should be like this. Fold it. Then you turn the side back and then you fold all four triangles again. But do the same thing on the back side. There we go, it should be like this. So now the both sided is folded. Now what do you do? Sorry guys, so after folding with the both side, so you take the front side and you can write um, numbers on them or you can write colors on them. So for now I'm just gonna write numbers and you can take your markers and you can write the number so now you fold it into half again but like this and it's going to be a little hard to fold because the paper is going to get thicker but that's okay you can try again So after, it should be like this into half. So after folding it, 
see if you can't like put your fingers underneath from here I have an easy method for you guys so you take these two parts if your fingers can't go inside here and you can't hold it so you just you just press in the middle it's not happening Now this one is a tight paper so mine is not happening but what do you do you just do like this now I know it looks weird but this will be easier to put fingers now you put your fingers underneath it in all the four sides lift it up now take this like this that's a technique it will be easier also so I did wrong my paper is a little bit tearing so be careful when you do this because your paper might tear And once you get that, try to fix the corners. My paper got dead from the side, but it's okay. And fix it from here. And there you have it. See? So that, and then you can write, uh, you can open it again. Once you're done, and on the front part here, you can write the numbers. Let me quickly write the numbers. So you can write numbers here, like one, two. You can write the numbers like this you can write numbers or you can write colors so I wrote numbers and you can also write the numbers like one two three four or backwards also so I wrote it like this and then after that you can also make a design behind the fortune teller but I did I'm not doing it so after writing the numbers inside of you flip it inside and you can all the you can flip all the things and you can write your fortune teller like today I'm going to get a friend, today I'm going to have a great day, something like this. You can write in all of these and then you're done. Then you can flip it back. Then you can flip it back. Oops, I did it wrong side. Then you can flip it back and play with your friends. You're ready to play with your friends. There we go. You're ready to play with your friends. So guys, that's how you make a fortune teller. If you guys like the video, make sure to like the video. And make sure to subscribe if you're new. And please click that bell if you guys want to get notified whenever I post a video. And if you you know you see this eye, I got a star here. So I don't know how I got this. Sorry if my eyes look a little bad. So that's how you make a fortune teller guys and comment down below if you want to see more craft videos because the other fortune teller video I made, I deleted it because it was not looking bad so I made a new one for you guys so hope you like this one and I'll see you guys next time.